gosh, if I'm already tearing up at the beginning, what is this movie going to do to me? Hey, it's Addie, and today we are watching The Green Mile. This is one of those movies that I pretty much constantly get recommendations for, and I think it was after the Shawshank Redemption, I had so many recommendations for this movie. So I'm so excited to finally get into it, finally to see what this movie is about. I I honestly don't know if I'm emotionally prepared for this, but I am excited to watch it. It is a movie that's definitely been on my list for a long time, so I am excited to finally watch it for the channel. So ready or not, I guess I should just dive in. This is The Green Mile. We have a little interest here. Two pieces of dry toast, extra things. Dry and cold, same as always. Cold is better. What do you do up in those hills? I like to walk. Mm -hmm. I hope he doesn't get stuck out here in the storm. Oh. I think it's more than just a walk, I guess. You look tired, you're not yourself. A few bad dreams, it happens. Oh, oh this here is worth a look. <laughs> what is it? Go take a look. Yeah. Something about the song? Something about the movie? I guess sometimes the past just catches up with you whether you want it to or not. I ever tell you that I was a prison guard during the Depression. Death Row was called the last mile. We called ours the Green Mile. That year, I had the worst urinary infection of my life. And there he is. You're right in there. <coughs> I don't think so. You should have took the day off going to see the doctor. It's not as bad as it was, sir. Huh? Oh. Dead man! He's enormous. Can't be bigger than you. I think he might be. We got a dead man walking here for a second. Do we have to? No. Yeah, do we have to do that? Can you talk? Yes, I suppose. Mm -hmm. I can talk. Move your ass. Let's go. Why don't you go see if they can use some help? Ah, they got all the men they need. Okay, so far, not like in Percy. I don't care where you go, Percy. He's just a moment's not here at this very moment. He doesn't seem like they like Percy either. <laughs> Dude. Percy, get the hell off my block! Okay, I've known Percy for like a minute. So far, I hate him. Your name is John Coffey. Like to drink, only not spelled the same. My name is Paul Edgecombe. Questions? Do you leave the light on after bedtime? Because I get a little scared in the dark sometimes. Oh my gosh, if I'm already tearing up at the beginning, what is this movie going to do to me? We always keep a few lights burning. So sweet. Right now, I want to hear about this new inmate. Aside from how big he is. He deserves to fry for what he done. But did he do it? Ah! The girls! The girls are gone! Look, Dad's blood! Ah! I tried to take it big, but it was too late. You on the rest for murder. Is this only making it look like he did it, but he didn't actually do it? How's that pretty gal of yours? Linda's not so well, Paul. I'll be taking over to Vicksburg next day or so for some tests. I had an angry call from the state capitol about 20 minutes ago. True, you ordered Poissy Wetmore off the block? It is. Mm -hmm. Like it or not, the you wife of the reason. governor of this state has only one nephew. So Percy gets away with whatever he wants. Well, crap. The man is mean and careless, and sooner or later he's gonna get somebody hurt or worse. The Poissy has an application in a Briar Ridge. Then why is he still here? I think he just wants to see one cook up close. Maybe then he'll be satisfied and move on. You give Melinda my love, okay? What are we looking at? Right there. Okay. He's like, all I see is a door. Oh, bro, no. I'll be hip deep in my soul. I just wanna see what it'll do. Cookie. And you're, you're just running back? 
All of this for a tiny, tiny mouse. Saw me a mouse go by. Oh. This is not what I expected this room to be. Oh, they had to empty out the whole thing. Oh my gosh. Are they even going to find the mouse? You let him get past you. I've been here all the time. The mouse the expert is would never allow that to happen. Three grown men outsmarted by a mouse. That's the last we'll see of him. I think we're gonna see Mr. Mouse again. I hope we see Mr. Mouse again. Yes! Yeah, <laughs> Honestly, I'm rooting for this mouse. No. He's gonna kill this freaking mouse, isn't he? See what he does. Percy? Uh... Don't do this. Literally everyone's fine with the mouse. We're chill with the mouse. I'm gonna rip your disease head off! Jeez. Oh, I she met your mouse. Over a freaking mouse. I'm gonna squish a little son of a What is wrong with you? We already tried that. Knock yourself out. <laughs> I hope none of them help him. You wanna think about what you were doing just now? I was trying to get the mouse. They are under enough strain as it is. Men under yeah. strain can snap. Anybody doesn't like it? You can kiss my I don't like it. They don't like it. Oh, don't yeah, you try it. I I hate him. I hate that he can just get away with anything. You ever threaten a man on this block again, we all gonna have a go. You done? I hope Percy has what's coming for him at some point. Let's move. I want at least two rehearsals before he gets back. Walking the mile, walking the mile. Sitting down now. What do I do? Watch and mm -hmm. learn. All I want. Soak the sponge. Yeah. Why is he putting that sponge on his head? Conducts electricity directly to the brain. You don't ever throw the switch on a man without that. God have mercy on your soul. I'm a done tom turkey. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad I didn't actually see that because it's just their rehearsal. I don't want to see this tomorrow tomorrow either there are witnesses you think if a man sincerely repent that he might get to go back to the time that was happiest for him i just about believe that very thing had me a young wife when i was 18 spent our first summer in the mountains that was my best time you'll do fine it's kind of hard to say that when they're about to die Are we actually going to study? Electricity shall not be passed through your body until you are dead. God have mercy on your soul. It just has to wait for the exact second. I want to watch this. Again? Dead. Drop us a card from hell. He's paid what he owes. So keep a hands off him. What's up his ass? You. Always. Yeah. You. Take that job at Briar Ridge. Well, I might just take it too. As soon as you, you put me out front. Seeing a man die. Now that's not enough. You be rid of me. I swear. I don't, I don't trust you. I might just stick around for good. Bob's. Kind of has to do it to get rid of him. Uh, Percy's the worst. You are not going to believe this. <laughs> no. <laughs> Watch what he do. <laughs> <laughs> what a good little mouse. He's smart, Mr. Jangles. Mr. Jangles. <laughs> Wanna play fetch? Wanna play fetch? Oh. What a smart little mouse. <laughs> and now I'm just really afraid that Percy's gonna kill you at some point. There's some smart mouse now. Yeah. I hear a circus mouse or something. Oh. When I get out of here, he's gonna make me rich. Just watch it, see if you don't do Percy, it. Percy, back away. Get, aw get away from the situation. Looks like you find yourself a new friend there, Dale. Well, Dale says his name is Mr. Jingles. We ought to find a cigar box. That should do real nice. Um. Man said get a cigar box. I don't trust Percy for one second. Al, you want to see me? Oh, no. Close the door. This does not look like good news. You got a new prisoner coming in here tomorrow. A problem child. Killed three people and hold up. It's a tumor, Paul. A brain tumor. 
It's the size of a lemon, they said. Oh, my gosh. I can't think how to tell my wife she's going to die. Dr. Bishop. That bad. Mm. Oh, yeah. William Wharton, uh, you put on these clothes now, you hear? We're gonna have to do this. Look more like a lamp noodle to me. Percy, don't do this. You gonna ride the light, man? Mm. Could you shut up? Give us a hand here. Mm. Buddy, you need to go to the doctor. I need to see you down here, folks. I got things to turn to just now, John Coffey. Oh, that was all an act. Oh, man. Oh, and he, he kicked him in a very painful spot. I need to party now! Is it a bad Oh, he doesn't want to do this. Hit him, Percy! Hit him! Hit him! No, Percy! What is Percy? Yeah. Does Percy want him to get shot? What is Percy's problem? Oh, come on! Come on, dude. First thing you make the report to the warden for me. Well, what about you? You're about ready to collapse. Go on, now go. Boss, I need to see you down here. It's not a good time at all. I don't think you can even walk over there. I need to see you closer. Cause you know you ain't supposed to do that. What do you want, John Coffey? Just to help. What? <laughs> Looking a lot better. Now well, let's see what comes out. Okay. So that actually worked. It was a very weird situation for a second. How you feeling? Oh, a lot better. Too bad. What are you doing? I think you know what he's doing. Yeah, he's feeling better. Yeah. <laughs> he's feeling a lot better apparently. We haven't gone four times in one night since we were 19. Yeah. Four times. Feeling a lot better. I'm thinking of taking the morning off sick. Sick. You're sure you ought to do this? I'm not sure what I'm sure of. Mr. Hammersmith, your office said I might find you at home today. And I hope I'm not troubling you. I'm e block supervisor up on Coal Mountain. The Green Mile. I love seeing them in movies together. Joan Coffin, causing you problems? No, no, no not he, at all. he doesn't like the dock and cries on occasion. He's kind of solving problems. He had a lot to cry about, I'd say. I've wondered if he ever did anything like that before. There doesn't seem to be any real violence in him. You came up here to see if I think he did it at all. He was found with the victims in his arms. We had us a dog, just a sweet mongrel. Mm. He still has the one good eye. Lucky not to be completely blind. The dog attacked my boy for no reason. Just got it in his mind one day. My dog never bit before. But I didn't concern myself with that. Is Coffee guilty? Yes, he is. I kind of doubt it, though. No more, John. You stand here, buddy. Smell him with some cornbread. It's mm -hmm. from my missus. You're bringing him cornbread? Thank you. It's your missus, please. <laughs> yeah, I think so. <laughs> Several times. Four times, to be exact. Oh, John, I smell that from over here. I surely can. Can I give Dale, Mr. Jangles? You can do with it as you please. It's for Dale and Mr. Jangles. Oh. I'm gonna get some too, innit? I think I'll just keep the rest in here. <laughs> That's fair. Yeah, you do that. Oh, that's so very oh. fine of you. <laughs> Mr. Jingle Tank, you, my mama tank you too. Don't you hold that on me. No, you don't need any. You'll keep a civil tongue on my block. <coughs> oh my gosh. Oh, I really hate you, you now, too. That one for free. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> yeah! Oh my gosh. We better need to clean out that room for a while. Oh, yeah. Here, Buddha. That's oh. Right now. Okay, so yeah, they hit, they don't right. use the room. Right. But it looks like they're about to. No sneaking up on me this time. We're gonna man to man. 
Piss on me. Cornbread, sir. Nope. I'll, I'll learn my lesson. I'll be good. So. You're gonna go for that moon pie. What? What is he doing? What is his plan? Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, he hasn't learned his lesson, apparently. No! 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 That moon pie thing was pretty original. Gotta give him that. Yeah, he has great ideas. It's a big day for you and Mr. Jingles. Important folks heard about your mouse. One's a politician all the way from the state capitol, I believe. Knock him for a loop, yeah. Knock him for a loop, Bill. Mm. It's like Mr. Harris said. I've been fixing the plumbing here for 10 years. There's a VIP today, Earl, so just shut up. Electricity shall now be passed through your body. Roll on two. Let's do it again. Sounded just fine. Thank you. So if we do this, we can finally get rid of him, right? They love Mr. James. Mm. They laugh over there, they cheer, they clap. We're happy for you. What's up with you, Percy? Boo! Dale, you numbwit. Now I was just having... Ah! 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 Wharton! Ah! 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 I'll just fly him. Look, hey, you don't piss it bad. You talk about this to anyone. What happens on a mile stays on a mile. You just keep on laughing. <laughs> oh, that's so uncomfortable. What about Dean? He's got a little boy. He'd love to have a pet mouse, I bet. How could a boy be trusted, Mr. Jenkins? I'll take him then. You live out in the woods. He be scared to live out in the big woods. You think you can trust him, though? How about Mouseville? Mouseville? Tourist attraction down in Florida. They got this big tent you go into. Mouse City. Yeah, there's mice that swing on trapeze. <laughs> mice that roll barrels. Yeah, that's the place for Mr. Jenkins. <laughs> Gonna live in a mouse city down in Florida. Oh, there he goes. Oh, no. No! He did not. What is wrong with him? Well, I knew I'd get him sooner or later. I knew Percy was gonna do something to that dang mouse. Give him to me. Please, John, help him. Oh, dear Jesus. And then that happens every time. Yeah. I really didn't expect this kind of element in this movie. I did not expect John to have powers whatsoever. What'd you do? I hit Bill Mouse. Boss person ass. He stepped on Bill Mouse and took him back to Mouse State. Was he trying to save the girls at the beginning? He said he tried to take it back. Screw you, Percy. You're just a mouse. Mouse is fine. I heard the thing crunch see for yourself i hope he's not gonna try to kill the mouse for a second time don't let nothing happen to mr jango he switched him somehow i always keep a spare mouse in my wallet for occasions <laughs> such as this hey just who the hell you think you are huh? ah! the hell do you think you are i put you out front for dale you put in your transfer to briar ridge the very next day that's the deal all right you better keep your word if Percy does not keep his word, I swear. Edouard Delacroix, will you step forward? Don't let nothing happen to Mr. Django, okay? Oh, I'll take him, boss. Yeah, you take him, John. You, you take him till this foolish one be done. You gonna take him to Florida to that mouth view? Maybe take a little vacation time. You're a good man, boss. You too, boss. Oh, I hate that Percy has to be the one beside him. Roll on one. 
You be so quiet, so still. You have anything to say before sentence is carried out? I'm sorry for it. I give anything to take it back. Don't forget about Malfield. There's no such place. What is wrong That's what the with fairy you? Tale these guys told you to keep you quiet. Electricity shall now be passed through your body until you are dead. Something to say? I didn't know the sponge was supposed to be wet. You freaking liar. He's putting in a transfer request to Briar Ridge tomorrow. Yeah. You're about 10 seconds away from spending the rest of your life in the padded room. Oh, damn. I can feel it from here. What do you mean? Oh, that's what was happening. He out of the die, though. No matter how it happened, Dale's a lucky one. Awful time now, boss. Dog time. The most I've ever cried in a movie. <laughs> and that's saying a lot because I just watched Infinity War. Y'all saw what he did to the mouse. He did the same thing to me. What's he got to do with us? You're thinking about Melinda. So you're talking about taking John Coffee to her. Could we do that? That's prison time. We get caught. You're dang right it is. But let's not discuss this as if we're thinking of doing it. I think we're thinking of doing it. And let's not forget John Coffee is a murderer. I do not see God putting a a gift like that in the hands of a man to kill a child. If he tried to get away... If he tried anything, anything at all, we'd have to take him down. Tell us what you had in mind. I think we're gonna do this. You think this is enough? I don't know. I'm gonna get something to you, ain't I? Oh, they're knocking him out. Come on, Mom. I've been good, I've been good all day. I have... Does he have any idea of this plan? Y'all get to drink, I'm thirsty. You gonna stay behind? I'll be good. Is he gonna do something stupid, like throw it in his face? You drink it all? <coughs> How long is it gonna take? Well, didn't take long. I guess as long as he's not actually faking it this time. So, that'd be just too. fine. I'd like to take a ride. I guess we're all in. Oh, what are we doing? What is this? Oh, that's what we're gonna do with Percy. No, no, you let me go! Please, Paul. You can't do it. We can. Mm -hmm. We are. Yeah. Give you a few hours of quiet time, Percy, so you can reflect on what you did to Dale. So that's what they're gonna do to Percy. Cool. We go for the ride now. That's mm. right. We going for the ride. Oh, oh, no. No. Oh, no. You don't. oh that's bad. Millions, right? <laughs> How are you spinning? You bad man. Yeah. I see stars. He's so happy. It's Kathy, the lady in the rocking chair. John, we have to be quiet. Go, go. Oh, 
All right, big boy, let's get so him the happy. It's just the little things that he's missed out on. Boss, look, someone's up. It's it's your friend. Okay, he definitely does. He definitely does not know this plan. Please don't shoot him. He's out there. Who's by that truck? Air of the lights. Now take it easy, now. Oh don't gosh. you move, wait. Hal, put John. the gun down. Hal, Hal, who are you talking to down there? She's having a bad day. What do you want? Just to help, boss. That's all. You can't. Oh. No one can. He actually might be able to. Oh my gosh, my heart is racing. I just don't want anything bad to happen. It's all right now. Don't come near me. Love you. Love so many scars. Don't hardly remember, man. What's your name? John Coffee, man. Like to drink. Only not spilled the same. You be still alive. <laughs> oh my god. This has not happened before. Half an hour, like you done before. Is this time different? Just let me be. How did I get here? A lot has happened. We were going to the hospital in Vicksburg. Yes, it was clear. Yeah. There was no tumor. What's your name? John Coffee Mail. Like the drink, only not spilt the same. Okay, so she remembers some. I dreamed of you. We found each other in the dark. Take it, John. It's a present. I want you to have it, Mr. Cole. Keep you safe. Wear it for me. Is this time different? Like, is he never come back? I'll give you a few days. Sit <coughs> down on your bed now. What about Mrs. Morris? America? Yes. I really just want him to go away. I take that tape off. You're gonna be calm. My mother always said you do it fast, it won't hurt so much. Mm. Okay, she was wrong. <laughs> I think it still hurt a little bit. You sabotaged Dale's execution. Sabotage how you pissed yourself. Like yeah, you did. Let bygones be bygones. Hmm? What happens on a mile stays on a mile. May I be let out of this coat now? Thank it all for Percy. Is he gonna transfer? Oh my gosh, that's definitely what What's happening? Did he save that in him to pass on to Percy? Or was that just like convenient timing? Well, I imagine Percy. Percy's gonna die pretty soon. Are you all right? I don't think so. Oh, that's creepy. Mm. What you looking at? Percy is so creepy. Oh! Oh! kill Percy? Or is it just out of his system? I punished them bad men. Why Wild Bill? I saw what Wild Billy done. You saw what? Can he show you him? You see for yourself. Oh, he can. <laughs> it was, it was him. What is wrong with you? So John was trying to save the two girls, but I guess it was too late. That's the way it is every day, all over the way. Percy Wetmore. First I thought it was unfair that Percy shot him, but then we found that out. Does this have anything to do with what happened in my house? Kind of. Oh. Whoa. Okay, Percy. Kinda got what what was coming for him. But John should not be in the prison. He should not be on death row. There's no way out of this for you, is there? This is the first time I ever felt real danger of hell. I guess you know we're coming down to it now. Another couple days. Is there anything special you want to eat for dinner that night? So we're actually having to go through with this? Even though he's innocent? Meatloaf be nice. Maybe some of the fine cornbread your missus make. You can say a prayer if you like. I suppose I could if it came to that. We were 
actually have you to go through with this? I had to ask you something very important. No. I know what you're gonna say. Tell me what you want me to do when I stand before God and he asks me why. What am I going to say? You tell God the Father. It was a kindness you done. I'm tired of boss. I'm tired of all the pain I feel in here in the world. Pieces of glass in my head. Well, there must be something we can do for you, John. I ain't never seen me a flick of show. This is what you wanted to do before you died. <laughs> I just wanted to watch a movie. Are these angels? Angels just like a man. Oh geez, the tears are flowing. Please today be the day. Please tell me Percy is not involved in this whatsoever. Oh yeah, Percy's gone. Okay, whoa, so much has happened in this movie. Be alright, fellas. I'll be all right in a little while. I'll give it back after. I dream Mr. Jingles got down at that Mousefield place. How they laughed at his tricks. Those two little blonde-headed girls is there. We all watched Mr. Jingles roll that spoon. How we did laugh. There's lots of folks here that hate me. I feel how we feel that. But we don't hate you. Kill him twice, you boys. Wipe your face before you stand up, Dean. John Coffey, you have been condemned to die in the electric chair by a jury of your peers. I'm sorry for what I am. Please, Bob. Oh, he's here. I'm afraid of the dog. Oh, my gosh. Go right in. <laughs> None of them want to do this. Electricity shall now be passed through your body until you are dead. May God have mercy on your soul. Yeah, I have to say. He kill them with their love. That's how it is every day. All over the world. We're over on two. execution I ever took part in. Both transfer and out took jobs with boys correctional. You said you and Jan had a grown son in 1935. The math doesn't work, does it? Do you feel up to taking a walk? I was hoping maybe John lived on his own, that he was visiting this house that they kept secret or something, but that clearly did not happen. Wake up, old fella. And he brings him Come bread here, boy. every day. Come on over here and see this lady. The mouse is still alive. Bienvenue au Cirque de Mousy. That's Mr. Jingles. I think Mr. Jingles happened by accident. When he took my hand, a part of the power spilled into me. He infected us both, didn't he, Mr. Jingles? I'm 108 years old, Elaine. I've had to see my friends and loved ones die all through the years. It's my punishment for letting John Coffey ride the lightning. Who I'll die eventually. Mr. Jingles? Where have you been? And he watched what after Mr. Want? Jingles for all of those years. I lie in bed most nights thinking about it. One thought keeps me awake most nights. How much longer do I have? Sometimes the great mile seems so long. I honestly just feel like a little stunned after watching the end of the movie. You know, like in the middle of the movie, I was really feeling like if anything happens to John, I will riot. I will not be okay. Everything leading, Jesus is going to get me again. Everything leading up to his death and the fact that they gave him the option, like they were going to let him run or leave and he just wanted to be out of his life. He just wanted it all to end because he was feeling so much of the pain in the world. That's, it's what he wanted, but it was so heartbreaking. And the fact that none of the guys wanted to go through with it, like it was heartbreaking for all of them. This is a really heartbreaking movie. I, I, I'm glad I didn't know a whole lot going into it. 
Like, I had no idea, especially because they don't show it right away, but I had no idea that John would end up having powers or that he had powers the whole time. I didn't expect <laughs> that to be the storyline. John is such a special person and I don't even know, I'm like choking up just talking about it. Um, I don't, I kind of want to read the book honestly because I, I'm curious if it goes into any of a backstory of how he was created or who he was or just more about John or what his miracle powers were. Do you see, do you see this? <laughs> I'm still crying just talking about it. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I kind of want to read the book now because there's there's so much. I'm sure a movie can only show you so much um, and maybe it kind of leaves it up to the reader or it's kind of a mystery but I definitely want to know more about the story and kind of dive into it a little bit more. What's also interesting to me is that um, I always thought Stephen King was like solely horror, which is not the case whatsoever. I mean, I watched The Shawshank Redemption recently. I watched this and they're not horror stories whatsoever. And it's just funny that that's what I associate Stephen King. But as far as those two, I mean, Shawshank and this, I mean, like what incredible stories. Um, this one, I don't think I've ever cried as much as I have in this movie, and that's saying a lot considering how much I cry in all of the movies that I've watched in the past. This one really broke me. <laughs> I mean, uh, it's so sad, it's so heartbreaking, but, oh, and I mean, all of them have to live with that for the rest of their lives, and obviously Tom Hanks' character Obviously, he has a touch of a little extra life from John, so he has even longer to deal with it. He know he has who knows how long to deal and to hold on to that. A lot of parts were so sweet and touching, especially with John. Like, what what a character! I love him so much. I mean, he did so much good, but he because of that, he held on to so much pain. Um, it's hard to talk about it because I'm still like kind of shaken up and kind of stunned from this movie but this is an incredible movie I I'm so glad I've now seen it I, I'm gonna take have to take some time to um recoup to kind of build back up to another tearjerker I guess but I'm probably gonna cry some more to be honest I mean what a story I think I'm just gonna end it there well that was The Green Mile <laughs> Thank you for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe and we will see you next time.